This episode of Ties I Help is brought to you by Netflix. What's up guys, today Apple released their new Messages app, so in this video I want to give you a demo of that. It's essentially iMessage for Macs, uh, and it also works with iMessage. I don't really know why they didn't call it iMessage, but whatever. Uh, you can chat from Mac to Mac, uh, or you can chat from Mac to iPhone, iPod, or iPad. It uh, works across all devices, and it syncs up across all devices when you're using it, because uh, you do log in to this through your Apple ID. Uh, so I'm going to give you a quick little demo here. Now this is in beta. If you want to download this, I have a link to my website in the description uh, where the download link is, or you can just go to Apple's website. Uh, again, this is beta. There's a lot of issues. I've been hearing a lot of people complain saying they have problems, uh, but I personally haven't had any problems. Okay, so here is the Messages app. Uh, you see the icon down here in the dock. That's what it looks like. Again, it's basically just like iMessage uh, on your iOS device. So over here to the left, you've got your conversations. Uh, which you can start a new conversation by hitting this little right button up here uh, and then you can add new contacts or add a contact to the chat uh, this also supports group chatting uh, by hitting the little plus button right there or you can just type it in you can type in their phone number uh, or their iMessage email address which I'm not going to tap on the little blue button because I don't want you to see my contacts alright so anyways I've got a conversation started with my girlfriend right here ignore what I'm typing I'm just doing that to hide her phone numbers uh, and then mine uh, which is actually my iPhone right here which is on 3G I put it on 3G just so you guys uh, can get an idea of how fast it will actually work over 3G because obviously Wi-Fi uh, should be better but we're going to try over 3G alright so I'm going to say hey what's up and as you see right there it says I'm typing now, it also does deliver read receipts and tell you when someone's typing uh, just like it does on the, uh, the iOS devices again or obviously it doesn't work well just like iMessage doesn't on the iOS devices alright so as you see right here it says that I'm typing I'm gonna hit enter and there you go it immediately sends so that was really quick uh, now I'm gonna reply back on here hey sup alright as you see it says I'm typing already and it basically immediately went through. As soon as I hit send, it popped up there. It actually seemed faster than finishing on my phone. There's also a little FaceTime button up here, uh, which you can tap and you can select your contact and it basically just opens up the FaceTime app for Mac. Uh, so you can use that. Uh, they should have integrated it in one app, but whatever. Uh, and then also, since this is a uh, replacement to iChat, uh, you can also use AIM, uh, Jabber, Yahoo, uh, all the services that iChat worked with from what I know uh, and basically use this as your iChat client now. So it's a replacement for it. So iChat is dead as of today. Well, this is a beta, but you know what I mean. So there you go. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what you guys think about messages for Mac in the comments down below. I'm interested to hear what you guys have to say. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you click the like button down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel because uh, that'll let you know when I post new videos. Now, before we head out of here, let's take one last look at our sponsor for this video, Netflix. With more than 23 million members, Netflix is the world's largest subscription service, instantly streaming movies and TV episodes over the internet. Members can instantly watch thousands of titles on a vast array of devices, including the iPhone, Xbox, PS3, Wii, Apple TV, and more. As a Netflix Unlimited member, you can watch as many movies and shows as you want, anytime you want, and there are no late fees or due dates. For a limited time, as a new member and a Tiza Help viewer, you can get a free trial if you just go to netflix.com slash tie and sign up. Uh, make sure you use that URL so they know that I sent you. Netflix is also now available in the UK and Ireland. For UK, just go to netflix.co.uk slash tie. And for Ireland, go to netflix.ie slash tie. Check it out. The next release of the world's most advanced desktop operating system. By bringing some of the most popular features from iPad and iPhone to mount...